Bruce uh, Wilby traveled uh, across Canada 100 years ago, um, and he actually got a, uh, took a bottle of water from the Atlantic and took it across the country and put it in the Pacific. So we're, we're commemorating that. We're also commemorating the 50th anniversary of the Trans-Canada Highway. Highway project, Sun Country Highway. It's all about creating the infrastructure for cars like this. Yes, yeah, it's actually uh, about uh, allowing the industry to move forward because for the last 110 years, the industry has always been stopped because the infrastructure wasn't in. So the, the concept's real simple put in the infrastructure in one of the biggest countries in the world with the most uh, diverse uh, geography and, and climate. Just uh, coming from uh, Newfoundland, uh, heading to uh, Victoria, BC, in this 100% electric car to prove that uh, you can travel coast to coast in one of the largest countries in the world, one of the most geographic and climate diverse, uh, in the middle of a Canadian winter. Here's the, an example charging station, yes. mm -hmm. and uh, your mission with Sun Country Highway is to create the infrastructure of the charging stations, so you're partnering with businesses, like hotels for example. Basically what we've done is went across Canada and said, look, uh, we'll provide the charger, you provide the install, it's a it's a win-win program, so all the partners have actually bought into the movement, so that's restaurants, hotels, tourist locations, it's a way for businesses to attract people to their, uh, to their establishments. We take you now to Regina, where the bitter cold isn't stopping a bright idea. CBC's Jeff Leo has the story. Kent Rathwell has set up more than 100 of these charging stations across the country. High speed chargers designed to give electric cars a fast boost. social, environmental sustainability for Canadians. Kent then put, put a goal on, on my shoulders that uh, I've never had on my shoulders before. And he said, Chris, I'm putting you in charge of developing the world's longest green highway. 
um, and we got to get this all done in a year. And so uh, here we are today, and we pulled it off several months in advance, and we've, uh, we've launched the longest uh, green highway in the world. And I just got some police here. Yes. Take a look at your car? Yeah, sure. No, no not a problem. <laughs> okay. Do you, to, so, do you want to talk to John Garmley, too? <laughs> so yeah. anybody wants to come by and join the police and having a look at your car, good stuff. Kent Rathwell, president and founder of Sun Country Highway uh, Safe Travels, and uh, we'll see you soon. Thanks very much, John. This is News Talk Radio.